What is up guys, Smith Alien TV today with another video and I'm actually hiding behind the vehicle because the wind is absolutely pumping 35 kilometers an hour right now and I want to do American pocket rod fishing challenge. <laughs> I'm not sure how it's gonna go but I'm very thankful I got this rod from Brian as one of my mates from America. So he came here down to South Africa for a tour and he brought uh, with him this little pocket rod which he gave me as a gift and I'm gonna use that thing today. I'm gonna put on a spinner bait first and check if I can get any big fish. Like I've wanted to do this video for quite a while now. I've actually had it since I think June or July, but uh, I didn't want to do it then because it was winter. So I was waiting till the season is here and the season is not really uh, fully yet, but I really want to do it. And I think it's going to be a fun video, especially if I can get some fish on it. And then if I get enough fish, I'm going to switch rods to the ducker rods, the amazing rods. And then I'm going to try and hammer the fish. But um, yeah, for now, let's try to get that pocket rod set up and see if we can get some fish, man. Enjoy! Can't get a hold of my obsession I just want you in my possession Never giving up, no fight Not letting you out of my sight Never giving up this time for real guys so that's what the box looked like it says pocket fisherman spin casting outfit so let's open it up i actually have opened it up before but i want to show you guys and there we go there's the bad boy let's put that back it actually looks i don't know if you guys know those vacuum cleaners like you clean but it looks sort of like that and then there's your little handle they tie it on this weight so you can practice your casting so basically that button folds it up and you can literally Hook it onto your pocket if you want, but uh, yeah, and then uh, the line on here is super light line. It's not really good line. There's a little drag system right there. You can adjust that because if I get a big fish, yeah. Um, and then that button is basically like the the thumb knob on your bait caster. So let's try cast this thing. So basically, you press it. Oh no, you don't press it. You you press it while you cast. And that's pretty hard. <laughs> but there we go. Reel it up. And yeah, let's tie the spinner bait on you and let's see if we can do something. All right, let's try. First cast, got the little spinner bait tied on. Oh, that's all right, cast. Fishing the old spinner bait, I'm supposed to hold it like that, yeah. There we go. I really cannot let this thing get snapped because I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to change the line because I have no idea how it works. I actually tried uh, in the week and I couldn't change the line and almost broke it, so. I'm too scared to, oh, oh no, that's a bad cast. I'm too scared to change the line. This thing costs really hard. Oh, see, it's literally going like a meter. That's going to be a problem. I had to figure this out. Oh, I almost hit myself in the face there. Oh. Oh man, I'm, 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 I'm actually on! My first proper cast, I'm on! And it's not a small one! Oh! Oh damn, oh damn, oh damn! Spinner bait! He's in the grass, he's in the grass! It's a, it's a good one! It's a good one! I'm actually so surprised! Oh damn, come here! Come here, come here, you donkey! <laughs> oh my word! On the spinner bait, on the pocket rod! I cannot believe this! I literally, it's my first proper cast! I'm bringing it back! And right in the grass, this donkey nailed it. Look at this. Yes, he's bigger than the pocket rod. <laughs> this is absolutely insane. I, I didn't think this was going to work, honestly. I've come to this farm dam a few times and I've struggled. And this was my first proper cast, which I actually got into the water. <laughs> this makes me so happy. It's a, it's a swamp and spinner bait with a little paddle tail. And that is probably like a three, three and a half pounder. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> oh. 
Guys, I've wanted to do this video so long. Oh, let's get a release on this bad boy. Damn, that was fun, man. Wow, I, I'm really, I can't believe that I actually nailed this donkey right now. There we go. I must say, I am really honestly very shocked that I landed that fish because the drag on the pocket rod was way too loose. The fish just kept peeling it. And I literally, I wasn't casting far, but I think it's because of the wind, so the fish can't really see me properly. And I think the spinner bait is just on right now. Well, hopefully I, I get another one, but let's see. The thing is, you have to get this timing like perfect to snap my spinner bait off. It's only spinner bait I had here. Yeah, since I, I really think that I'm going to be losing quite a bit of stuff, I'm going to try to keep it on a budget and not go with my flashy swimmers. <laughs> I think I'm going to just use some, like a Texas rigged uh, swim bait. I think that's going to be better. There we go. We got the weight on. Let's put the swim bait on. Just rig it like a Texas rigged plastic. I think that's going to be best for me right now. And that's what it looks like. Looks pretty juicy. Let's see. See, I don't even have my scissors here, so I can't even clip off this tag end. <laughs> All right, so I'm really struggling, so I'm going to make a plan. I'm going to click it, hold it, and then I'm going to chuck it. Ah! There we go. We got some distance now. That worked. Let's see if we can get anything. Come on. Come on. Nothing. Well, at least we made a plan now. So we can try to catch more fish. Got some distance now. A little bit of a cheat, but <laughs> you know, you got to do what you got to do. All right, guys, just a little mid up. Just want to have a chat with you guys about a few things. Uh, so firstly, we've just caught that one fish on the pocket rod, and I'm very happy with the size of that fish. I mean, I did not expect to catch a fish on it, honestly. And nevertheless, catching like a 1.6, 1.7 kg bass. So I'm very happy. Then we're going to still keep fishing, and hopefully we can get one or two more. Uh, that just makes a video better if there's more fish catches in the video, because it is a fishing video. Um, but then the other thing, I read some comments of you guys and I saw a lot of you guys had this idea that you guys want to make me some lures or modify some lures and then send them to me and then me basically trying to make a video on them basically like a you make it I fish it type of a series so if you guys want to do that I'll put my PO box in the description if you guys want to send me some stuff that you want to make and you guys want me to fish it send it to me um, let's make a little fun little series about that and then I just want to give you guys a big thanks so much we hit 800 subscribers guys 800 800 that is making me happy. Uh, like I really didn't think it's gonna come this fast, honestly. I was, I was hoping to hit 800 before the end of the year, but at this rate, we're probably gonna be able to hit 1,000 before the end of the year, hopefully. So let's keep pushing it, and let's see if we can hit that 1,000 mark. There we go. Oh, he came up for it. He came up for it. Let's go back. Let's get back in there. I know it's not on the pocket rod. Uh, Cause I've just been struggling my ass over that little thing. He missed it though. He swelled up to it, but he missed it completely. There we go. There we go. Now we're on. Now we're on. Yes, this is a giant. This is an absolute giant. Whoa! <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, baby. Calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down, calm down. Would have been absolutely sick to catch this dog on the pocket rod, but you know, I just can't cast it with that pocket rod. I can't pitch that pocket rod. It's just a struggle, but I still wanted to catch fish. And look at that donkey, I'm just gonna wash him off. There you go, let's wash this bad boy off. Look how beautiful he is. Absolutely beautiful. That's probably another three, three pounder. Beautiful. I need to take a selfie with this one before I release him. <laughs> All right, let's release him. Ah, gotta get a nice shot, yeah. Oh, he's already biting me. Beautiful. That makes me so happy. I really hope you guys have enjoyed this chesty, chesty footage. I know it's not the same, but I'm bank bashing. And I'm just doing as you guys asked me. So I put up a Facebook post asking what you guys think. And uh, yeah, one of you guys said I must bank bash a little bit more. So here I am. <laughs> There we go, fish on. Oh, I took it as it came up. There we go. It's a good one, it's a good one. Oh, figured it out. <laughs> I knew there had to be a bigger fish here somewhere. Oh! 
All right, guys, I know the wind is absolutely pumping once again. It is very, very hard to fish. And I was wanting to fish a lot more of the moving bait just because of the wind. And I know the fish is gonna bite on that, but uh, there isn't a lot of bank space to fish. And I just wanna give a big thank you to Yuhan Yubad uh, for letting me come fish his farm dam. Absolutely amazing place. You guys saw the fish that came out. I literally lost like a two kg. Uh, heart's broken, but uh, yeah, I was throwing a crank and I was like, I'm not sure what to do anymore. I've punched, I've fished the spinner bait, I've done weightless, I've done weighted mojo rig, everything. And I was like, okay, let's just crank these, the dam wall, because there's rocks and that little piece didn't have grass. So I started cranking, I felt the rock, boom, and I stopped and I knew it was going to float up. And as it was floating up, I thought, doo -doo -doo, and I set the hook. And um, yeah, it's just one of those that just came off, but it's one of those things that's fishing. If you guys are new to the channel and you guys haven't seen my channel yet, please hit that subscribe button, it's going to help me a lot. And hopefully this video gets a lot of views because of that pocket rod, it's absolutely amazing. I was, I was very surprised that I actually caught a fish on it because uh, I didn't get a proper hook set and I couldn't fight the fish properly. You know, it's a challenge video and I really enjoyed it. So if you guys did too, hit that like button and subscribe and comment what you guys thought about it. And uh, yeah, we'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.